Okay guys, so I just want to make this quick video on how to grind the menus, a little tutorial, how to grind infinite end core hero upgrades, 83 team of the week player picks, 81 player picks, duplicate exchanges, get yourself some coins and not have to spend any FC points. So let's get into it. What you're going to want to do, you might want to favorite some of these things. I've got the uh, end core hero upgrade, team of the week player pick and the 87 to 89 dupe exchanges favorited. You will use other stuff, but I've just got these one favorited because these are the ones I go to the absolute most but um let's get into it if you want to favorite those that will be a good place to start but every single day you want to make sure that you come over to the upgrades and you're going to have daily bronze silver and gold upgrades to do they're nice and easy you just need like one bronze player for this you get 12 bronze players you can do that twice a day same here for the silver one silver player you get 12 back you can do that twice a day then you put these stuff into the daily gold upgrade where you get some more bronze and silver players back and you get some gold players very worth doing each and every day you can just do this and that will get you started with the menu grind as well you will want to go through with the objectives do your daily plays and stuff like that get all of your packs like that that you can get and that will help you massively with this grind you're most likely already got all of these things underway uh, you're doing the daily upgrades every day and you've got players in your club and stuff like that and that will be great So once you've done those though, you're gonna have some stuff in your club You're gonna be able to put that stuff straight into the player picks and uh, What I will say is don't put anything above 80 into the player picks You want to only use 80 and below and uh, once this loads up we do have this set and ready to go and we'll st uh, turn that in and yes, yeah, so once you've done your daily upgrades there, your daily objectives, all of that type of stuff, you open your packs, you go run them through player picks, making sure to save anything above 80 rated. 80 and lower you can use in the player picks. So then basically we're going to have some player picks here to open. We crack them open. If at any moment you get from your daily upgrades, we are going to take the 81 just so I don't have to throw stuff away too much in this video. But um. If you're lucky, you might get something from your daily play or your daily upgrades and stuff. Maybe a team of the week or maybe like a high rated piece of fodder, which is great. That's going to really help you with the grind. But basically, what you're looking for with these 81 plus player picks, absolutely everything can be used. There we go. That is absolutely perfect, by the way. So we're going to run you through what you can use stuff for. And... Uh, We'll just open these picks, see if we can get anything. Obviously, we've got the Kimmich there, which is fantastic. That's going to go perfect into the grind. When you're getting things like the 88s, that's going to just really help fuel the grind. But all of these things, 81s, 82s, 83s, genuinely are really, really good for the grind as well. You will need them as well. So do not worry if you're getting, even sometimes you will get like little little runs where you're only really getting 81s to 85s. Genuinely, that's absolutely fine. What you're going to be doing is 81s to 85s. You're going to be putting into the team of the week player pick and the 86s. What I'm going to say is 86s, just kind of save. 87s, try and save as well, but if you need to use them, you can use them. If you run out of 88s or 89s, use the 87s in the dupe exchange. Same with the 86. Uh, if if maybe you've got a whole bunch of 85s and you just want to quickly use one or two in the dupe exchange, you can do that. But um, realistically, I, I'm at the point where I only really use the 88 rated, 89 rated, the odd 90 rated here and there in the duplicate exchanges to fill yourself back up with a bunch of stuff. But so basically the 81s to the 85s in the team of the week upgrade, 86 to the 89s into the dupe exchanges. You can use 90s on the odd occasion. You can use 85s on the odd occasion. And I would say try and hold on to your 86s and 87s. Use 88s and 89s first. That is what I would say. So from these player picks here, we did go and get, well, we got a bunch of stuff, but we got Hundahun and we got Kimmich. So these things are going to go straight into the duplicate exchange. For now, because I've already got a bunch of stuff here, we're just going to put the Hunderhun into the 86 upgrade here. So we'll quickly go do that. And then, uh, for now, with Kimmich, we can just hold off with Kimmich. We don't need to go and open that right now. We don't need to go and use that right now, but... 
do feel free to go and use 88s if you just need to get some stuff in your club. Use your 88s, use your 89s. Don't feel like it has to be a dupe. Don't feel like, oh no, I can't use this Neymar. Are you going to use it in a game? Probably not. Just throw it in. Get yourself 51 players. Get yourself some dupe exchanges. Let's just say, for, for example, we did just go and put an 89 and we'd have 51 players. That's some more player picks. But also in, in these types of packs here we'll quickly open it but in these types of packs here you're going to obviously get your 81s to 85s for the team of the week upgrades you can sometimes pack some extra walkouts which will go back into the duplicate exchange um and then anything 80 and lower go back into the player picks with the player picks you're obviously going to be opening them you're going to be getting stuff and that's that's where the constant grind is going to come in right now uh every time you basically get a walkout, you go throw it into a dupe exchange, you do your dailies, your objectives and everything like that. And uh, so yeah, there we right now we've got the two eighty threes here. I would say what we're gonna do with these. The seventy six would go put that straight into another eighty one plus player pick. And uh, the eighty threes, now that we've because they're dupes and we know that we do have enough, we can now get started. Just, so, just because what I will say is it's best to not throw stuff away. I'm kind of at the point where I wouldn't, like, be against. In fact, we can come back to the Team of the Week player pick. So make sure every day as well you're going to have things like the 83 times 10, the 85 plus player pick. You get 84 times 5s and stuff like that. When you have a bunch of uh, 83s, which we, you always get, once you're doing this grind, you're starting to get some stuff in your club. 83s, 82s, 81s, 84s, you're just going to have an abundance of. Even 85s, an absolute abundance of. So uh, this here, obviously the team of the week. Right now, you might not have one, but... Um, that's where the team of the week player pick comes in. If right now you don't have a team of the week, uh, rather than coming and doing this, go and do the team of the week upgrade. Um, so just just for just for that sense, no, no, no. We will stick with the eighty three times ten. But if you do not have a team of the week, don't go buy one. Go and do the team of the week player pick. This will cost the exact same price as the higher rated squad for the team of the week. Just without the team of the week. So an 85, 4 83s and the rest 82s. One of them for a team of the week in the 83 times 10. But in the team of the week player pick, you obviously don't need the team of the week. Um, so we're going to send this right now. Team of the week, 4 83s and... Uh, the rest 82s that's going to give us an 83 times 10 and you can do this three times a day these will go like it expires in one day 12 hours but then they might bring back something like the 84 times 5 they might bring these back they might bring something else back but always try and make sure to do these they are worth it if you're going to go and buy a te team of the week it's not worth it but as long as you're doing this menu grind where you're using the dupe exchanges the player picks and all of that the 83s and the team of the weeks are going to cost nothing for you you're not going to be in any sort of worry about getting those done you'll be able to get all three of those done every single day without failure and um nice and easy let's hope that we did use these two right so we didn't use these two for this for the sake of the video i'm going to throw them away let's just say we did use those two 83s in this uh, 83 times 10 that's what i would say try and do when you're doing things like this try and make sure that you're using the things that you have duplicates of what i would say as well is use the duplicates to figure out where you're gonna go next right so say here we got like an we're getting an 87 rated player let's say this was a dupe it's cobalt i would go put this into an 87 rated duplicate exchange we got return as well so 87 and 88 instantly that that there that's a 27 player pack and a 19 player pack which would just go back into uh player picks team of the week player picks all of that type of stuff. We also got Colera in there. So that's absolutely insane. Stones is obviously an 85 rated player. Which is going to go in the team of the week player pick. Really nicely. The 84s and 83s all come in handy. And uh, right. So we're going to have to go and work this one out here. But this is actually perfect. This is actually perfect. So say, say you get a situation like this. Where we've obviously got a dupe. We've got Colera. 
we go put this into the 51 duplicate exchange and that is just going to continue the grind but if say you know you're comfortable you what will yeah, there's so many things you can do with 90 rated players if it's a dupe and you're comfortable you can go do like an sbc like right now i'm working on ribbery i could go and put that into the 90 rated player um but instead for right now we're gonna just go straight away and put it into the 51 player pack and that just secures me a whole bunch more players to be able to do a bunch more player picks that will continue the grind um then obviously we have those free 83s that we need to use. We can just hold on to that pack right now because we got that. We know that from the 83 times 10, we got an 85. We got some 83s and stuff like that. We should have some 82s. 82s are real nice and easy to get. You only need what, like six? Even if you need to use maybe an 83 to use two 81s instead of uh, three 82s, that can be done. We need to just go ahead and throw an 83 in here. Let's try and use one of the ones that was just in that pack. Yeah, Asensio gone. Hopefully that was a dupe. If it is, that'll be nice. But there we go. So we got the 85, the four 83s, and then we got the rest 82s. That's the higher rated squad for the team of the week player pick. And then you get a tradable pack back from it so obviously this is where you will slowly just make a whole bunch of coins for uh it's one of those ones where it might seem a little bit like oh, it's only a mixed players pack but that's 12 players there will always be four golds four silvers four bronze which can be run back through the uh daily upgrades that we get every day so you're never going to run out of uh bronze and silver players there make sure that you do implement the team of the week player pick because that's going to be a massive massive part of this so we're going to go ahead and open this pack see what we get oh some i am the bra <laughs> let's go so somebody has just subscribed as i'm filming the video here but so we didn't get anything out of this pack but that is absolutely fine uh you're still going to be making coins regardless. Right now, I would just send this stuff to the club. But if you are in need of coins, say you're doing this from scratch and you don't have much, I would say go and sell every single one of these players. This will be 700. Me personally, I'll quick sell it for the 550 instantly. But um, for the gold common players, always list them 500 when there is player picks available to do because they will sell for 500 if you get to a point where your transfer market's full that's the perfect time to go ahead play some games do you know what i mean then you get some coins for playing your games but you can also work towards objectives work towards your division rivals your squad battle rewards all of that type of stuff if there's daily play your free daily games you get your xp all of that stuff so uh for now, I'm just going to store the rest of this stuff. I'm going to quick sell that to get the 220 coins. But I will say, do list that stuff. Even if it's min price, you will make some extra coins if you are low on coins. If you get to the point where you're at like 25k, you can go buy an 89 rated player. And you can open the 51 player pack, which is going to just fill your club with a whole bunch of stuff for the... Um, player picks and then you might get something that's you might i've had plenty of times where i've packed 89 double 89s triple walkouts and stuff from these packs which can all just go back into the dupe exchange and uh all the other stuff into the player picks 81s to 85s into the team of the week player picks and you're you're loving it you're loving it over time you're going to get a whole bunch of stuff in your club that will be tradable with the team of the week exchanges so make sure to always check if the players are tradable don't just uh don't just go and use the stuff in your club that is tradable but right here always check prices as well because as you see there that could have actually been worth a little bit extra a lot of the time in this uh game they're actually probably not uh but right here we've got an 84 an 81 so they're going to go into team of the week player pick the 82 can also go into the team of the week player pick or another 83 times 10 and then the rest of this will go into an 81 plus player pick and yeah the grind just continues so we're going to go ahead and use those things we probably won't use those things specifically i've already set up for the video to try and make it as quick as possible and as you know as easy to get through as i can so we've already get it, got it set up. If we don't use Rabio, that's fine. But here we go. The 82 rated squad 
is going to be costing you two 84 rated players, which is unbelievably easy to get. And the rest will be 81 rated players, which again, you are never... There might be a moment where you don't have any 81s, but at that moment in time, you probably have used your 81s on Team of the Week player picks. You're not necessarily needing to do an 81, uh, a Team of the Week player pick. So I wouldn't worry too much about this. You're going to get this done nice and easy. Just make sure you're always using untradeable. Always use untradeable. Uh, just so you're making the absolute most out of everything. I will say I always preach don't throw stuff away. But I can't lie. Once you start getting really into the grind and... Honestly, probably saves a little bit of time to throw something away here and there. Um, but anyway, so we've gone ahead and done that. Let's just say we had used those players, you know what I'm saying? But um, now we've got the Team of the Week player pick. And here, so here, here with these ones, right, you can obviously get 83 plus, but you rarely ever see anything below 85 but um, if you get 85s, I would say always hold on to the 85s for things like the 83 times 10s. 86s, 87s, I would just kind of store them until you need them. I'm going to take the 86 for now. But say if you get like an 87, I would also kind of just store for later. But if you get like an 88 or an 89, do feel free to go ahead and throw it straight into a duplicate exchange. I regularly throw my 89 team of the weeks into a dupe exchange because... I would rather get the 51 players and go again. But, obviously, we're going to throw these away here. But let's just imagine we didn't do that. But for the sake of the video, speed things up a little bit. We're going to throw that away. But that has obviously now secured us the team of the week. Which can go into a whole bunch of things. A whole bunch of team of the week. A whole bunch of upgrades. Or anything like that. Whenever a team of the week comes out, you're never going to have to buy one. You're always going to have to massive selection of team of the weeks. I've got, I probably have 30 plus team of the weeks in my club at all times. Um, so you will never run out of that. But here we have obviously another tradable pack from just doing that squad. You get three golds, three silvers, which is pretty nice. This is going to be 84 rated, I think, right? Is that 84? That is 84, so that's also actually some decent coins back from this pack. You do not mind the 84s, but uh, as I say, you can either do what I do, because I'm really stocked up right now with uh, everything that I need. I'm just going to store it to the club uh, for a later date. Sometime, a lot of the time, I'll end up just quick selling the silvers and the rare golds um, that are duplicates, just to get the coins in and not have to mess about with trying to sell them but obviously if you have i would say if you have under 80 things in your transfer market list your stuff list your stuff um because you will you obviously want to try and make as many coins from what you're doing as you possibly can but anyway so as you're coming along you would have been doing all of these uh like you do your dailies you do your player picks, you put the stuff from the player picks into hopefully some duplicate exchanges, you open the duplicate exchanges and you get some more stuff for the player picks, you get a bunch of 81s, 82s, 83s, 84, 85s which go into the team of the week player picks and um, all of this will just be constantly recycling but over time obviously as I say use the 88s and 89s mostly into the duplicate exchanges, your 87s, your 86s, you kind of want to hold on to for as long as you can, if you need to use one here and there, go ahead, but um, over time you're going to just be stocking a whole massive bunch of stuff, like 85, 80, like you'll have a whole bunch of 85s, you can obviously put them into the team of the week player picks but you only need one each time so do feel free to throw some 85s into here it's not going to be no bother you're going to have plenty of 85s but what i tend to do with these ones here is either use maybe one or two 88s some 87s and then like some 80s maybe an 86 some 85s some 84s some 83s or like some 87s some 86s some 85s and an 84 stuff like that um this this will be real nice and easy to get you will not have no problem getting this over time as you're grinding all of the uh everything that i've explained through this video you'll be able to get this really nicely easily done you won't have no problem there and uh obviously from this pack as from these from this specific spc you also get 
tradable packs back there as well, which is really nice. That's going to help towards your uh, funds. Over time, you're going to build up a real nice coin balance. And do feel free to go spend it in the store. Do feel free to go spend it in the store on some of those fodder packs. Test your luck trying to get something nice. And if you don't, you're just going to get a bunch of fodder, which will just fuel the grind as well. Um, or save your coins for a solid player. You'll be able to rinse through SBCs and all of that type of good stuff as well as you're doing this. Uh, I'll, I'll give you a little quick look at my club <coughs> of what we've racked up over this last like few days. Obviously, I've done... I always do the objectives and all of that type of stuff. Um, like the cups and stuff. And that's just going to really help fuel the grind but also you'll notice from the videos that i'm also always doing like the icon player picks and stuff and it's all free all fueled by the grind i don't put no money on the game and genuinely it's a lot easier than you'll think give it a try watch the video as you do it and uh, hopefully this video has been good enough explanation for you guys to understand. But here again, so you're going to have the 85 team of the weeks. You're going to be getting these so much more regularly than you will imagine, guys. The 85 team of the weeks come out all the time whilst you're doing your daily gold upgrades, even your bronze and silver upgrades. Um, the team of the week player pick will often give out 85s, 86s, and you will rarely ever use them. Obviously, then you've got three eighty four eighty threes, the rest 82s. Make sure to always check your gold commons because there will always be some 81s and 82s lying in there and they will help. But let's just, we'll leave it like that. We can have a little flick through just the things that we've got here. Most of this is all just cut. In fact, all of this has just come from the grind. All of this has just come from the grind. Pretty much anything that's like 90 to 88 that uh, I'm not going to use in a cup or games. I just go and put it into the duplicate exchange. Get me a bunch of player picks. A bunch of players. Run it all back through the grind. And it's just infinite. Genuinely infinite. Absolutely crazy. Every video you're seeing at the moment on the channel. Is fully funded through this menu grind. So do not sleep on it guys. It's absolutely crazy. And uh, yeah. Let me know if you need any assistance if you need any uh extra knowledge if you have any comments any maybe you've got a little bit of a better tactic maybe a little something else that i'm missing but it, uh, as you can see here you will get to a point where you just have infinite of everything you just don't run out you just don't run out. So uh, here's another thing that you can do. As you can see there, I had a bunch of 84s. We've obviously got this hero player pack that we've done over the time. Uh, we will open that as well. We will open that as well. But over time, whilst you're doing this grind, you're really going to find yourself getting so many 84s that you... Or like almost every time you do do a few player picks you're getting duplicate 84s and you will end up wanting to throw them away because it does get annoying uh the 85 plus player pick you get two of these a day at the moment absolutely perfect for this it expires in 13 hours hopefully they bring a new one back but this will cost you 984s 283s this is literally free in my opinion the amount of times i've gone ahead and just thrown um free uh an 84 rated team into this and packed absolutely crazy stuff from it but then as well if you just pack something like an 87 88 89 that's great fodder you just put it back into the duplicate exchange it'll all then get run back through the player picks through the team of the week player picks back through duplicate exchange and right now obviously we've got the hero pack as well you're going to be building coins Packs, picks, infinitely, without fail, without having to spend any coins, any money on this game. So there we go, 984s, 283s. We'll just open this up, see what we get. Genuinely though, uh, <clears throat> sometimes I throw away way more than 984 plus players in one day. Just from... Just from... Not you know one of those ones where you just want to kind of be a bit faster. So do get these done. Really worth it. 
And uh, these will just help fuel the grind as well. Every time you get an 89... <laughs> I knew it was going to happen. Every time you get an 89 rated player, you basically now have 51 players to go and do something with. Inside of that 51 player pack, you get something crazy as well. Throughout this entire grind, there's no limit to what you can get. There's no limit to how much you can do. Just let me know how you're getting on. Let me know what you think of this video. I know it's a bit long. It's a bit drawn out. I probably explained a few things over and over again. But um, I just wanted to make sure that this was as specific as it could be. And uh, let me know how you're getting on with it, guys. I do appreciate you all watching. In fact, I'm going to throw away Perejo right now. We'll get it out of the dupe exchange. And let's open up this hero player pack. Just in case, you know. Could be crazy. We should have a tradable pack there as well from the end there. And uh, genuinely, the amount of walkouts and stuff I get out of these packs. Promos, everything. And that just brings the coins in. Let's go. 86 plus hero player pack. Let's go. What's it going to be? It's a base. Wait, what's that? Oh. Is that, what is it? Cordoba? It is Cordoba. He's a beast to be fair. He is a beast. An absolute beast in game. I don't think he'll be worth too much. But uh, realistically, you can go straight ahead and put that into, you can either use it. He will be really good in all the cup things that we've got going on at the moment. He is an absolute beast. Uh, maybe he might even make your team, to be honest. But if he doesn't, you can straight away go and put him into a 19-player pack and start rinsing it back into the recycle. You can use it back into the hero player pack. You can use it anywhere. You know what I mean? So everything, there is a place for everything. And uh, yeah, hopefully you guys have understood let me know how you get on with it. Shout out to you guys that made it this far. I really hope it does help you guys. And uh, I'll catch you in the next video, guys. I appreciate you all watching. Peace out. Peace out. Peace out.